Proverbs 21 and 16. The man that wandereth out of the way of understanding shall remain in the congregation of the dead. Galatians 4 and 9. But now, after that you have known the Most High, or rather are known of the Most High, how turn you again to the weak and beggarly elements whereunto you desire again to be in bondage? Kohaloyim, by Yahweh, by Hashem Yahushai, by Hashem Yahushai, double honor to the head elders, the apostles and bishops of Great Millstone. Shalom to you, Akim, here and abroad. It's the brother Yarza Yun, back with another quick vent session. And Lord willing, you'll be edified in these short lessons. Yeah, so the scriptures say in Proverbs 21 and 16, the man that wandereth out of the way of understanding shall remain in the congregation of the dead. Okay? So it's, we ought to be grateful that Yahweh Bashem Shai took us out of the way of the congregation of the dead, dead and put us in the way of understanding. All right. So the water Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai, you know, that is something to be very grateful for, you know, and to continue to pray. All right, that we endure, man. All right, because look at the majority of the world. Look at the world for what it is. These people are waxing worse and worse and it's just it's just it, there's there's a is a dead end road there's a dead end road for these for these damn stupid idiots out here in the world man all right they're not going anywhere they're just on a fast track to destruction all right their mentality their bad habits their perverse mind state everything all right they're in the congregation of the dead man because the lord is going to really make them dead in a painful manner you know and we know what the uh, outcome all right of america is when you how about shimmy out shy is through with it all right we're in the process right now but this place becoming more and more through, you know? The scriptures say, many great miseries shall be done to them that shall dwell in the latter time because they have uh, walked in great pride, man. All right? So the water of Yahweh Shai for pulling us out of the congregation of the dead, all right? It's mentally and Lord willing, he's going to literally do it physically when Yahweh Shai returns all right to deliver us into those chariots all right to save us out of this worst case scenario that we're in man we're just surrounded by filth the Lord took us out of that filth and that is something to be grateful for man and not take it for granted all right and to continue to fight the good fight of faith because these people ain't got nothing to fight for, man. They just going to go with the crowd. They're going to go with, you know, the, the, the carnal way. What feels good and what makes their flesh comfortable. And they're going to end up rotting away, pining away. Because the wicked has the agenda and it has nothing to do with them. You know, the, that agenda we all we we should know by now is the uh, agenda to de depopulate the world. So we don't we don't want to uh, after we have received the knowledge of the truth and and, and the grace of Yahweh by Shemuel Shah to turn again to the weak and beggarly elements, on uh, where where unto they. Uh, you desire again to be in bondage bondage of what all right bondage of sin and to be destroyed man